grass-seed rape is an integral part of the UK arable rotation and a profitable break crop. In this short video, we will talk you through some water stewardship best practice principles to ensure autumn and winter applied herbicides don't reach watercourses. Our focus is on propizamide, an active ingredient found in key Corteva products such as AstraCurb, CurbFlow 500 and CurbFlow. Corteva, together with the industry and partners such as the Voluntary Initiative, water companies, catchment sensitive farming officers and farming advisors, is committed to helping growers use these key herbicides correctly. Let's dive in. When using propizamide, it's essential that all seed rape growers consider what action they can take to protect watercourses. After heavy rain, there is a risk of propizamide being washed into surface water. Although typically, only a small percentage of the applied propizamide is lost and it doesn't have an effect on the aquatic environment, it can present a challenge to water companies when they're producing drinking water. They must ensure that drinking water contains less than 0.1 microgram per litre of any pesticide. This equates to approximately 100 grains of sugar in an Olympic-sized swimming pool. Field selection, tramline placement and buffer zones can all play a vital role in reducing this risk, along with the normal precautions when loading and washing down the sprayer. Farmers should aim to grow all seed rape on low-risk fields that don't slope to watercourses. Appropriate establishment, direction of working travel, soil type and topography all need to be considered by each individual farmer. You should check that your planned all-seed rate fields aren't in a safeguard zone on the Environment Agency website. If there is a high risk of herbicides moving into watercourses, reconsider. During application, don't apply propizamide to cracked, dry or saturated soils if heavy rainfall is predicted within 48 hours. Curb weather data can again help you to make this decision. Propizamide works best when applied to cold, moist soils. This must be balanced with the need to protect water. Again, remember the key three things about propizamide application. You need the right rate, in the right conditions and at the right time. Only use the maximum rate of 840 grams of active ingredient per hectare for severe cases of black grass. Soils should be at 80% field capacity, which is one to two and a half centimetres of moisture and soil temperature should be at a maximum of 10 degrees centigrade and declining. Finally, remember that propizamide should be applied between the 1st of October and the 1st of February, but is most effective between late October and early December. I hope you found this information useful. There are a number of places you can go to find out more or seek advice on how to get the best out of propizamide containing products. Go to www.corteva.co.uk forward slash propizamide or ring the technical hotline on 0800 689 8899.